What's up, Tribe Squad? It's your girl, Shandiza101. Um, as you know, my name is Shandalay, and I host this YouTube channel. Um, I make bomb-ass wig reviews for beginners and girls who like hair, so make sure you subscribe to my tribe by clicking the link down below. Today, I'm going to tell you all you need to know about cutting lace. I know that with everything going on inside, I mean, inside, outside, in the world today, um, you're probably getting crafty, and maybe this is your first time wearing a wig because your salon is closed. Um, so I received a question in my inbox about how do I actually cut cut the lace on my wigs so I wanted to answer that question today for you um, and I wanted to do a detailed talk through so if you like that make sure you hit that thumbs up and let me know and I can make more videos like this and include them in a playlist that's easier to follow I use a razor you can use scissors I really it's interchangeable for me I prefer the razor because I think that it's easier for me to control over the scissors like I feel like the scissors um, kind of gets away from me and then I end up just cutting a straight line and with the razor I can just go piece by piece by piece and I'm gonna show you what I mean a little later in the video right now I'm just simply twirling and pulling a piece of the hair out next to the hairline um, you do need to be careful to avoid putting a hole in the lace I'm just saying this looks like I'm doing it really fast but that's only because I sped the footage up I took my time with that and I don't really think it made a huge difference um, but it's just an extra step it's completely optional um, let's go ahead and just take a look here. This is how I put the lace on before I cut it. <laughs> and like, the free spray can kind of get you, girl. Like, <laughs> that face though. Okay, so I spray a little bit over the top. Um, and I let it get tacky. I give it about 30 seconds. And I spray a little underneath the lace. I just think that helps me um, have it adhere a little easier it's just not everyone's choice so you don't have to do that you could just put the free spray underneath honestly whatever what you need to understand about cutting the lace is watch a bunch of different little reviews and um, how to's and then find your method that works I have a, a piece of every little thing that I've learned over the years and this is how I've been doing it and been slaying it bitch you know that's how i've been based my channel all right let's go vibe for a second while i let this dry and then i'll come back on here um i am going to show you just in the next couple clips before they come up how i laid this side and then also i'm going to do the exact same thing so i'm going to just let the music vibe and let's just kiki in the chat y'all if you're watching this premiere live um we're probably having a really good time in the chat so make sure you guys turn your notifications on so you don't miss the next one That vibe for so much and i was eating a um muffin i almost forgot to come back on here <laughs> okay y'all i'm back so sorry about that okay so let me go ahead and talk about the razor um one thing that i do like to do with the razor is i like to go towards the hairline and so what i mean by that is a lot of people think that you're just like how do you not cut yourself <laughs> and i get that that's a real that, that, that's a question but honestly the razor is not that crazy sharp um, and if you do it right you shouldn't be touching your head really at all 
Um, so you'll just want to make sure that you're paying attention to like how I do it. And I'm going to show you literally as close as you can get to like seeing it the best way I possibly can. So keep watching. Um, I did get a question that said, so I've never done a wig before professionally or on my own. And I think that's the case for a lot of women right now is they're trying to figure something new out because they can't, they're now realizing the way that they're working may not work forever. So she asks, is it as easy as I make it look on my videos? The truth is, is it's a process. It looks easy because I've laid thousands of wigs and I'm not even kidding. I literally have changed my hair practically every day in a year since I was 19 like that's just who I am so it does take practice but if you follow these steps and watch this video um you're gonna get what you need to know okay so like I said I'm gonna show you as close as possible first what I do is I'm going towards the lace and that's why I cut it into three sections it's easier to control and I use my finger to determine right here I'm trying to determine how close am I to the hairline and how much excess lace do I need to cut off? And I take my time, girl. I'm going piece by piece. Usually I speed this portion up so people think I'm just like flying through it. But the truth is, is this is how slow I go when I'm cutting the lace. Piece. And then I check it. I feel where I need to cut next. And piece. That's also a reason why I can do it practically not looking at the camera because I'm really not relying on my eyesight. I'm relying on what feels right. Um, and that'll take a while. So you'll want to be in front of a mirror. And I actually have a little mirror off to the ground, but it doesn't help me that much. Um, just because, trust me, when you're recording, it's different. But I also want to show you this is a darker lace. So that's a win for a darker toned girl because the problem that a lot of women have is that it doesn't match. It's a win for me too because I prefer that over like super bright lace. Um, but it is a little shade, just a hair, just like barely, you know, darker. So I should have went with a little powder, but I'm not. I'm not going to do that. But that's how I cut the lace, you guys. And if you need to, pause right here. If you're not catching the premiere girl and we're just laughing at the chat, you know, having a good time. If you're watching the replay, because I am hoping that this video is helpful for somebody who's trying a wig for the first time, run that back. Run that back and watch that. I probably have watched so many videos. I've watched myself um, practice and get better. So just run that back. I'm using a little got to be free spray just to cover those little pieces of the lace that I felt like were showing a little bit. I use my fingertips. The recommendation is to not use your hands. The truth is, is you're a beginner, so you're not going to know how to avoid using your hands the entire time you're laying a wig the first time. You're just trying to get the shit on. Truth be told, <laughs> let's just be honest. So this is really super simple, easy method. I got this razor at Dollar Tree. You can go pick one up today. Don't be nervous. If you're worried about cutting the lace, cut far from the hairline first and then go clean it up. The problem is, is you may be going in too early just trying to get that perfect cut and you may not get that that first time. Anyways, I hope this video was super helpful. I have an entire playlist of Bomb Mouse Wig Reviews that I drop often. I update the playlist often, girl. And overall, I'm just a fun, chill girl. So if you got questions, you want to know, um, just send me a DM on Instagram at Shandism101, and I am easier to reach there. Um, now, I will tell you, all of the next things that you're seeing are completely optional, girlfriend. You do not have to do them, but I think that they do add an extra step of realism. So just to talk about the specs of the wig, it is a light density. I would say that this is a beginner-friendly wig because you could cut it with scissors and be fine. Um, I think that the blonde collection is beautiful. The tangling is real. It could be because of the color and the length, but this wig would probably last about one to two weeks, honestly, if you're wearing it a lot. Um, so I would recommend just, you know, spread that out a little bit. You know what I'm saying? If you think that this video is helpful or you have a friend who may be thinking about wearing wigs, I'm on a journey to expand my tribe squad. So please share this video one time for you, girl. If you did catch this review live, I just appreciate you hanging out. If you want more information about the Kamani wigs, I put together a playlist of wigs and also helpful how to cut the lace videos down below in the comments section. Make sure if you're watching this video live, you come back and drop a comment and let me know what you really thought of this talk through. If you guys loved it, I'll do more. I'll see you guys Sunday at 6 Central Standard Time, 7 Eastern Standard Time, and 4 p.m. 
Pacific. Ta- uh, oh wait. <laughs> Alrighty, girl. Let me go. Bye, y'all. Thanks for hanging out.